if you want to install chrome os on your pc then this video will help you a lot because in this video i'm going to show you how to install chrome os dual boot without usb pen drive without linux mint on your pc if you are new to this channel then please consider to subscribe the channel before starting this process some important points to be noted the processors without integrated gpu will not support chrome os in chrome os no dedicated gpu support is there arm processors will not support chrome os for intel processors 3rd gen to 13th gen processors will support chrome os and for amd processors bistral edge and stony edge and the ryzen series processors will support chrome os first of all start your pc and access the bios menu of your pc if you don't know how to access the bios menu then you can refer this photo otherwise you can search on google on bios menu if your secure boot is enabled then you have to disable it then you have to enable the virtualization technology on your pc and after restarting just click on start menu and search for cmd and run as administrator and here just type power cfg.exe space slash hibernate space off then just hit enter close the terminal now on your keyboard press win key plus r and here type rage edit and then click ok here first of all go to hk local machine then system then current control set then control then scroll a little bit and you will find session manager select it and then double click on power here you will find the option hyper boot enabled just right click on it and click on modify and here you will have to put zero and then click ok now close it now again click on start menu and search for features and here you will find the option turn windows feature on or off open it here you will have to check windows subsystem for linux and virtual machine platform then click on ok and just restart your pc again and again after restarting just open microsoft store and then just search for wsl here you will find windows subsystem for linux applications should have been installed on your pc it is already installed on my pc then you have to install ubuntu ubuntu is also installed on my pc you will also have to install this you will also have to install this software on your pc then just close it now again click on start and search for ubuntu and ubuntu application we will find here just open it it will take some time to start after creating a profile on ubuntu after creating a profile you can start everything you can now close it now just open a browser and now you will have to go to this website a website link will be given in the description if you are on intel processor 3rd gen to 9th gen then you will have to download ramas if your processor is 10th gen to 13th gen then you will have to download voltier for amd processor you will have to download zork now here just click on view by code name just click control f as per your system just search here and here you will find zork list of chrome os you can download one of them just click on number and the download will be started here you can find on the same way you can also find for ramas you can also search for voltier voltier is also here after chrome os is download you have to search for branch 7 then you will have to go to this page branch framework and now here you will have to click on latest here you will find a tar.zz file just click on here and download will be started search for grab to win and go to the very first link source forge grab to win download here you will find the downloading just click on download and download will be started after everything is downloaded then close the browser and go to the download folder the download folder in compress folder you will find everything grab to win branch and chrome os and there is also a file called chrome is making code you will also have to download this file downloading link will be given in the description then minimize this folder now just right click on start menu and select disk management here you will have to create a minimum 60 gb disk space here you will have to create a drive with minimum 60 gb space select your drive and just right click on it and click on shrink volume and put the size here 60,000 and then click on shrink then again right click on allocated space select a new simple volume then click next then click next then click next put the name of this volume chrome os then click next finish okay the, the drive is created now open the download folder and again open this pc go to chrome os drive and just select these four files and select cut and paste here the four files are on chrome os drive now just select the chrome os zip file and right click on it and rename it as chrome os okay then right click again and select extract all and then click extract all files are extracted then just check this folder and select the chrome os file and just click on cut and paste it outside of this folder now minimize the folder and click on start and open ubuntu on this folder you will find chrome os img code just open it and here type sudo apt dash get update hit enter and update will be started okay update is done then just type cgpt then hit enter then you will find the actual command apt install cgp just copy and paste here just hit enter cgpt is installed then type pv and click enter here you will also find the actual command just copy the command and paste here hit enter pv is also updated all the commands will be given in the description
now just go to this chrome os drive and select the branch file and right click on this and select rename just right click again and copy the name and here and here on the code section just select the branch release name and right click over here paste then again select the chrome os and select rename and select all from starting to dot bin and right click on it and select copy and then again select the chrome os name and right click over here paste and now don't do anything and just here put the size as 32 it denotes the size of your iso file 32 means 32 gb you can put here the size as per your convenient but you will have to put here just like 32 64 128 just like this and then just select the chrome os drive and click here and just find the name of this drive is f okay and here you will have to put f and then just remove this select this command and copy paste here and hit enter okay now we are into the f drive that means chrome os now again type ls then hit enter all files are listed here now just select the second line and right click and copy and just come to the terminal and right click and it will be automatic pasted just hit enter here after tar put dot zz okay then again select and copy and then again paste and hit enter the process has been started you will have to wait here two thousand years later the process is completed again select this command and copy just paste it here and hit enter the process has been started you will have to wait here till it is being completed now you can find everything is completed oh my god wow then you'll have to select this dual boot command and on keyboard control c just right click again and dual boot and hit enter you can find dual boot text has been created now you can close everything okay okay now in this folder you can find a chrome os recovery that is 32 gb and it is the graph twin image text file now chrome os is ready if you have any antivirus on your computer then you'll definitely have to disable the antivirus OS protection okay now open the graph twin folder just double click on exe setup file and install the graph twin select okay now just click on setup now just close the setup program graph twin is open now on the very first screen just select the screen size of your computer and just click on manage boot menu click add a new entry and here just select sub menu and here put the title as chrome os and here the graphic style set the screen resolution click here edit custom code just open the command file press ctrl a then copy close it and just paste here and close save okay custom code is given here click on apply again apply and okay then again click on apply and then okay close everything is set now just restart your pc if your computer can't boot into graph to win then you will have to access your bios menu and on bios menu just go to boot and here on the boot priority first option you will have to select the graph to win efi and then just click on exit and then save and exit then yes and now in the screen you can find the graph to win is started just select chrome OS and hit enter then select branch and click enter here branch is starting you will have to wait here now chrome OS has been started click here get started and here you will have to connect your wi-fi or internet it's checking for updates you'll have to wait here now just select you and click next just put your mail id and then just click on next now just put the password and then click on next now the setup is ready accept terms and conditions then again accept terms and conditions now just select skip here you will have to select the theme light theme dark theme or auto let me select the light theme and the dark theme will be just like this light theme then click next and click get started promise is installed on your pc you can see this there is a play store games and everything you can download over here here it is the latest version you can find and it's very smooth but play store any application it is very smooth hope this tutorial was helpful to you if you find this tutorial helpful then please hit like and don't forget to share this video with your friends we will meet on another day on another topic. Till then, take care.